Hobbs valve are a specialist manufacturer of metal seated triple offset butterfly valves um, and covering uh, a vast sort of spectrum of industries. I would say oil and gas is probably 60% of what we do. Uh, marine is catching up. Um, we're basically the new kids on the block. Um, for a triple offset manufacturer being 15 years old, that's relatively new. Um, and we are sort of known as the innovators. The, the organisation was founded around 14 years ago by Alan Hobbs when he identified some inherent flaws in the traditional triple offset design and uh, using modern machining and modern design technologies uh, eliminated them. We win projects not on price, um, it's usually on technical aspects so the features and benefits that Alan Hobbs designed within the product um, are what put us above our competition. Um, SolidWorks we've used from year dot release for the inception of the company 14 years ago um, and it's, we use it in all aspects so from start to designing a product um, I use it myself as a sales tool when I'm out about on the road. Uh, it's, it's utilised throughout the company really so again it's, it's from concept to really manufacturing involved. It's incredibly important, um, particularly for uh, the type of organisation that we are because we deal with a lot of bespoke manufacturing options and it allows us to provide solutions for our customers and design bespoke options for them. The user interface on SolidWorks is by far one of the best. Um, if you use any other type of software, everything's a bit uh, dated, um, whereas SolidWorks is uh, quite up to date, everything looks quite, you know, clean, nice. As someone who isn't an engineer, um, I find that I've been able to pick up SolidWorks quite quickly and learn to navigate through the system uh, very easily to be able to support the guys where, where they need my assistance. I tasked the design house design team to produce 3D printed models for us um, from carting around sort of 20, 30 kilo valves all over the world as well isn't much fun. Um, so again, the 3D printed models after using SolidWorks programs uh, takes that down to less than a kilo and it's, it's just a lot easier for me. Um, I use augmented reality on the iPad. Augmented reality and 3D printing kind of come hand in hand. It, it helps breach engineering and sales together. We use a, a QR code, uh, just print it on a desk, um, then utilising e-drawings uh, through SOLIDWORKS programmes, we can generate augmented reality, so sort of full 3D models that we can move, highlight certain sections of the product, uh, and really sort of home in on certain features and benefits that we're, we're trying to offer the, the, the customer. It's all about visualisation, isn't it? And, uh, and it's the, the seeing is believing for me. We do, I have to have loads of renders. Every, every, every drawing's got a render on it. The guys within our engineering teams actually building models, so all the various valve components, um, every single nut and bolt, are sort of production design guys, they'll take that into the machine shop. So 5-axis CNC is all programmed again through, through SolidWorks, right, right through to the valves go out the door and assemble and test it. We, we started using design tables, and design tables is really good because we can lay out everything on Excel, on Microsoft Excel. Uh, what we want to do, plan all the dimensions before we actually then jump on into SolidWorks and start and start designing. So um, we can just plan out all the dimensions, all the tolerances, all the gaps, and then uh, import the design tables into SolidWorks. Um, and then it will just make the model for us. It, it, it makes everything a lot faster because we've been able to make a range, you know, with just uh, just a couple of people uh, really fast. Um, it's not just the only thing we do. We also do the structural analysis. Once we've made everything, we have to. We have to make sure that it stands up. Um, there's only so much you can do through using calculators, um, but we use finite element analysis. A simulation saves a lot of money because if you weren't simulating, you would be spending a lot of money on, on physical tests. Um, if you wanted to find out when your weight on when your shaft is going to break, you would have to literally break your shaft. It just it's just a massive. It saves so much money. So the future for Hobbs Valve as a whole really um, I think is product development, further product development on the triple offset. Um, looking at uh, our other products that we don't utilise as much, sort of uh, double block and bleed, uh, cryogenic applications as well. And I think SolidWorks is the way forward for that from, from concept right through to, to production.